Burt Reynolds, known for his charismatic performances in films and television, led a life full of colorful relationships and personal challenges. His marriage to Judy Karn ended due to his waning interest in romantic relationships and aftermath of their breakup. The actor's tumultuous personal experiences, however, never deterred him from delivering captivating performances that left an indelible mark on the industry. As we delve deeper into this classic star's life, we'll uncover more about his impactful relationships and the struggles he faced. Burt Reynolds, the actor who won the hearts of many with his charming smile and charismatic performances, had a significant relationship with actress Sally Field. Reynolds once referred to Field as the love of my life, highlighting the deep connection they shared. However, Field's perspective on their relationship was different. In her memoir, Field painted a picture of Reynolds as a controlling partner, detailing his substance abuse issues that led to their eventual split. She revealed that the actor's struggles with addiction made it challenging for her to maintain a healthy relationship with him. Despite Reynolds' public declaration of his love for Field, she felt it was essential to share her side of the story, shedding light on the complexities of their relationship. Reynolds and Field first met on the set of the 1977 film Smokey and the Bandit, where they played love interests. Their chemistry was undeniable, and they soon began a romantic relationship off-screen. However, as time went on, Field noticed that Reynolds' controlling behavior and substance abuse issues were taking a toll on their relationship. Despite the challenges they faced, Field and Reynolds remained close friends after their breakup. In interviews, Field spoke fondly of Reynolds, acknowledging the impact he had on her life and career. However, she also felt it was crucial to share her experiences and provide a more nuanced perspective on their relationship. In the end, Field's memoir offered a candid look at the complexities of Reynolds' personality and their relationship. While Reynolds may have seen Field as the love of his life, their relationship was far from perfect. By sharing her story, Field provided a more complete picture of the actor, highlighting both his strengths and weaknesses. Burt Reynolds and Lonnie Anderson's marriage seemed like a fairy tale in its early years. The two stars, who met in 1980, tied the knot in 1988, and their relationship appeared to be filled with love and affection. However, beneath the surface, cracks began to form in their marriage due to financial disagreements and infidelity. The couple's differences over money became a significant source of tension in their relationship. Reynolds, who had earned millions from his successful film career, struggled with debt and financial mismanagement. Anderson, who was also a successful actress, found it challenging to reconcile their financial differences. Infidelity was another factor that contributed to the breakdown of their marriage. Reynolds' wandering eye and reported affairs added to the strain in their relationship. Eventually, the couple's differences became irreconcilable and they decided to part ways. Their divorce was notoriously bitter, with both parties making public accusations and airing their dirty laundry in the media. The acrimonious split took a toll on their son, Quentin, who was only three years old at the time. Despite the strained relationship with his father, Quentin pursued a career behind the camera. He worked as a camera operator on several films and television shows, including The Last Movie Star, which starred his father. Reynolds' will, which was made public after his death in 2018, did not include Quentin. The omission added to the speculation about the actor's strained relationship with his son. In conclusion, Burt Reynolds and Lonnie Anderson's marriage, which started with so much promise, ended in a bitter divorce. The couple's financial disagreements and infidelity led to the breakdown of their relationship. Their son, Quentin, who was adopted during their marriage, pursued a career behind the camera, despite the strained relationship with his father and not being included in Reynolds' will. Burt Reynolds, a beloved figure in the film industry, continued working until the very end. In the twilight of his career, he secured a role in Quentin Tarantino's highly anticipated film, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Reynolds was running lines, preparing for the part, when he suffered a fatal heart attack in September 2018. His passing was a great loss to the industry and his fans, who would never get to see him in this final role. Reynolds' career was marked by his charismatic performances and his ability to captivate audiences. He became a household name in the 1970s and 1980s with roles in films like Deliverance, Smokey, and The Bandit, and The Cannonball Run. His performances in these films, and many others, etched his name into the annals of cinema history. Despite his success, Reynolds remained humble and dedicated to his craft. 
He was known for his generosity and kindness both on and off the set. His colleagues and friends spoke highly of him, praising his professionalism and his ability to make those around him feel at ease. As the end drew near, Reynolds was surrounded by those who loved and cared for him. He died peacefully, running lines for what would have been his final film. His legacy lies on in the many films and shows he graced with his presence, and in the hearts of the fans who will always cherish his work. The film industry will forever remember Burt Reynolds as a true legend, whose impact and mark on the world of cinema will never be forgotten. Burt Reynolds, the beloved actor, made headlines when his will was made public, revealing that his son Quentin was excluded from it. However, it was later disclosed that Quentin would still be financially supported through a trust. This decision is believed to be a result of their past estrangement and a protective measure against estate taxes. Reynolds had a long and successful career in the film industry with his breakout role in the 1972 film Deliverance. He became a major box office draw and a sex symbol in the 1970s and 1980s, appearing in numerous films such as Smokey and The Bandit, The Longest Yard, and Starting Over. Despite his success, Reynolds' personal life was marked by ups and downs. He was married twice and had one son, Quentin, with his second wife, Lonnie Anderson. The couple divorced in 1993, and Reynolds' relationship with Quentin was reportedly strained. In his will, Reynolds left the majority of his estate to his niece, Nancy Lee Brown Hess, who was also named the executor of his estate. However, he made sure that his son would still be taken care of financially through a trust. The decision to exclude Quentin from the will, but still provide for him through a trust, is likely a protective measure against estate taxes. By placing the assets in a trust, the assets can avoid probate and potentially reduce the amount of estate taxes owed. Reynolds' decision to provide for his son through a trust also reflects the complexities of family relationships. Despite their past estrangement, Reynolds still wanted to ensure that his son was financially secure. In the end, Burt Reynolds' legacy will live on through his classic films and his impact on the film industry. And while his personal life had its challenges, he made sure to take care of his loved ones in his own way. In the world of entertainment, few names resonate as strongly as Burt Reynolds. Born on February 11, 1936, in Lansing, Michigan, Reynolds pursued a career in acting after a brief stint in football. He first gained recognition for his role in the television series Gunsmoke, and later starred in several successful films, including Deliverance, The Longest Yard, and Smokey and the Bandit. These roles showcased his charisma, comedic timing, and action hero prowess, making him a beloved figure in Hollywood. Reynolds was not just an actor, he also directed and produced films, demonstrating his versatility and dedication to the industry. In 1998, he won an Emmy for Outstanding Guest Actor in a comedy series for his role in Evening Shade. Despite personal setbacks and challenges, Reynolds remained a prominent figure in the entertainment industry, leaving behind a legacy that continues to inspire aspiring actors and filmmakers. His impact transcended generations and resonated with audiences worldwide. Step into the world of Burt Reynolds, a captivating journey filled with laughter, drama, and unforgettable performances. Burt Reynolds, born on February 11, 1936, in Lansing, Michigan, was the son of Burton Milo Reynolds, a police chief, and Fern Hurt Reynolds. His upbringing was largely in Florida, where his family moved when he was just 10. Reynolds' early life was marked by sports. He excelled in football and even earned a scholarship to Florida State University. However, an injury sidelined his football career, leading him to explore acting. Reynolds' first exposure to acting came in high school when he played the lead in a production of Mr. Roberts. This experience sparked his interest in the craft, and he decided to pursue it further. He enrolled in a community theater workshop in Florida, where he met a man named Spessard Holland, a former governor of Florida, and a mentor to Reynolds. Holland encouraged Reynolds to take his acting more seriously and even helped him get his first professional job at a local dinner theater. Later, when Reynolds moved to New York to study acting, he met another influential figure, Joanne Woodward. Woodward, who was already an established actress, took Reynolds under her wing and helped him hone his craft. She introduced him to her husband, Paul Newman, who also became a mentor to Reynolds. Newman taught him about the business side of acting and how to navigate the industry. Reynolds' early career was marked by a string of television roles, including appearances on Gunsmoke, 
Hawk, and Riverboat. However, it was his role as Quinn of Spur on Gunsmoke that really put him on the map. Reynolds played the part for three years, and it helped him gain recognition in the industry. In the early 1970s, Reynolds transitioned to film, and his career took off. He became a major box office draw, known for his charm, good looks, and comedic timing. Reynolds' early influences and mentors played a significant role in shaping his career and helping him become the successful actor he was. Burt Reynolds' passion for acting took root in his college years at Florida State University. As a football star, a knee injury sidelined his dreams of a professional sports career. During this time, he enrolled in a drama class to fulfill elective credits. It was here that Reynolds discovered his love for the stage and the creative freedom it offered. Reynolds' natural talent and charisma were quickly recognized by his professors, who encouraged him to pursue acting professionally. He began performing in local theater productions, further fueling his passion for the craft. After a successful run in a production of Mr. Roberts, Reynolds decided to move to New York City to pursue acting full-time. Despite facing numerous rejections and setbacks, Reynolds remained dedicated to his craft. He honed his skills through years of hard work, perseverance, and a commitment to his art. From his early days on Broadway to his iconic roles in film and television, Burt Reynolds' creative spark has left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Burt Reynolds, born on February 11, 1936, in Waycross, Georgia, faced numerous challenges on his path to becoming a successful actor. Financial struggles were a constant companion during his early years. To make ends meet, he worked as a football player, even earning a scholarship to Florida State University. However, an injury cut short his football career, leading him to explore acting. Reynolds' transition to acting was met with skepticism by the industry. Despite his good looks and charisma, he struggled to find substantial roles. In an interview, he admitted to being rejected for over 40 roles in New York before landing his first acting job in a television series. Despite the rejections, Reynolds remained resilient. He once said, I didn't go to Hollywood to be a star, I went to work. This determination led him to take on various jobs, including driving a truck and working as a bartender to support his acting career one of the creative solutions Reynolds found to overcome industry skepticism was to create his own opportunities. He started appearing in comedic roles, showcasing his charm and wit, which eventually won over audiences and critics alike. His breakthrough role came in 1972 with the film Deliverance, where he showcased his dramatic acting skills. Reynolds' ability to adapt and his unwavering determination helped him overcome early financial struggles and industry skepticism. His resilience and creative solutions serve as an inspiration to aspiring actors and anyone facing obstacles in their path. In 1972, Burt Reynolds' career reached a turning point with the release of Deliverance. This intense drama, directed by John Borman, showcased Reynolds' acting prowess and marked his evolution from a television star to a prominent film actor. Co-star John Voigt praised Reynolds' performance, stating, Burt brought a gravitas to the role that truly anchored the film. Reynolds' career skyrocketed in 1977 with the release of Smokey and the Bandit. The film, which became a cultural phenomenon, grossed over $126 million domestically and cemented Reynolds' status as a bankable leading man. Director Hal Needham, who worked with Reynolds on several films, said, Burt had this incredible charisma that just lit up the screen. Smokey was the perfect vehicle for his unique talent. In 1997, Reynolds earned critical acclaim for his role in Boogie Nights, directed by Paul Thomas Anderson. As porn director Jack Horner, Reynolds delivered a nuanced and introspective performance that earned him a Best Supporting Actor nomination at the Academy Awards. Anderson reflected on Reynolds' performance, stating, Burt brought a depth and humanity to Jack that was truly remarkable. It was an honor to work with him. Despite health issues and personal setbacks, Reynolds continued to work in film and television, leaving behind a rich and varied body of work. His impact on the industry is undeniable, with his charisma, versatility, and undeniable talent continuing to resonate with audiences and peers alike. Burt Reynolds, a charismatic actor known for his rugged good looks and Southern charm, brought a unique approach to his work. He once said, I think the most important thing in life is to be gentle with yourself. This philosophy extended to his artistic process, where he aimed to create authentic, relatable characters. 
Reynolds' upbringing in South Georgia influenced his acting style. He often portrayed down-to-earth, straightforward men with a touch of humor. His ability to balance intensity and lightheartedness made him a beloved figure in American cinema. In films like Deliverance and Boogie Nights, Reynolds demonstrated his range, tackling complex roles with sensitivity and nuance. He could convey vulnerability and strength simultaneously, making his performances truly memorable. His personal experiences, including his time in the military and his football career, informed his work. Reynolds brought a physicality and discipline to his roles that set him apart from his peers. Despite facing personal and professional challenges, Reynolds remained committed to his craft. He once stated, I've always believed that if you put in the work, the results will come. This dedication to his art shone through in every performance. Burt Reynolds' legacy is one of authenticity, resilience, and versatility. His ability to connect with audiences and create unforgettable characters leaves a lasting impact on the world of cinema. Burt Reynolds, an actor who left an indelible mark on the film industry, was born on February 11, 1936. His charisma and charm were not only captivating but also influential. According to Kevin Costner, he gave a whole generation of actors the idea that you could be a leading man and have fun. Reynolds was known for his versatile roles in films like Deliverance, Smokey, and The Bandit, and Boogie Nights, which earned him an Oscar nomination. His impact extends beyond his acting prowess, as he was instrumental in shaping the industry's trends and techniques. In the 1970s, Reynolds was a key figure in the development of the action comedy genre. He brought a unique blend of humor and physicality to his roles, which inspired a wave of similar films and performers. As film historian Peter Biskind puts it, Reynolds' impact on the industry was significant. He showed that you could be a tough guy and a comedian at the same time, which was a new idea in the 70s. Moreover, Reynolds was a pioneer in the use of celebrity to sell movies. He was one of the first actors to understand the power of his image and used it to his advantage, often appearing on talk shows and in magazine spreads to promote his films. This marketing strategy has since become standard practice in the industry. Reynolds' influence can also be seen in the way he challenged traditional masculinity. He was unafraid to poke fun at himself and often played characters that were flawed and vulnerable. This departure from the stereotypical strong, silent hero was refreshing and relatable, making him a beloved figure among audiences. In addition to his influence on the industry, Reynolds also inspired countless actors and filmmakers. Director Quentin Tarantino cites Reynolds as a major influence, stating, Burt Reynolds is one of my heroes. He brought a unique energy and charm to every role he played. In conclusion, Burt Reynolds' contribution to the film industry is undeniable. His impact, from genre-defining performances to innovative marketing strategies, has left a lasting impression on both the industry and its audience. As film critic Leonard Maltin puts it, Burt Reynolds was a true original. He brought a unique blend of humor, charm, and machismo to every role, and his influence can still be felt today. Burt Reynolds, the beloved actor known for his charismatic performances, led a fascinating life outside of the spotlight. Reynolds was born on February 11, 1936 in Waycroft, Georgia, and grew up in a family that valued hard work and perseverance. His father, a police chief and former boxer instilled in him the importance of determination and self-discipline. Reynolds' love for football led him to play as a halfback for Florida State University, but a car accident ended his dreams of becoming a professional player. This setback, however, did not deter him from pursuing a career in entertainment. He enrolled in acting classes and quickly found success on stage and screen. Despite his fame, Reynolds remained dedicated to giving back to his community. He was passionate about supporting various charitable causes, including children's hospitals and organizations that helped those struggling with addiction. Reynolds himself had battled addiction and was open about his struggles, hoping to inspire others to seek help and overcome their challenges. One of Reynolds' most notable philanthropic efforts was his support for the Boys and Girls Clubs of America. He served as a national spokesperson for the organization and frequently visited clubs to inspire and motivate young people. Reynolds believed that every child deserved access to opportunities and resources that would help them succeed in life. Reynolds' personal values and interests often informed his work as an actor. 
He was known for his down-to-earth personality and his ability to connect with audiences on a personal level. His love for football led him to star in several sports-themed films, including The Longest Yard and Semi-Tough. Reynolds also had a passion for classic cars and even started his own museum to showcase his collection. In addition to his philanthropic efforts and personal interests, Reynolds was also a devoted family man. He was married twice and had several children, including a son from his first marriage and an adopted son from his second. Reynolds' love for his family was evident in his interviews and public appearances, where he often spoke about the joy and fulfillment they brought to his life. Burt Reynolds' life and career were marked by his dedication to his craft his commitment to giving back, and his love for his family and community. His legacy continues to inspire and influence generations of actors and fans alike. Burt Reynolds, a true Hollywood legend, leaves behind a lasting legacy within the film industry. With a career spanning several decades, Reynolds became known for his charismatic charm and versatile acting abilities. From his breakout role in Deliverance to his iconic performance in Smokey, and the bandit, Reynolds captivated audiences and inspired many aspiring actors. Reynolds' impact on the industry transcended generations. He paved the way for future actors, demonstrating the power of versatility and the importance of staying true to oneself. His advice to aspiring professionals is simple yet profound if you're going to have a career in this business. Always be true to yourself and never give up. Reynolds believed that staying true to oneself was crucial in an industry that often tries to pigeonhole individuals into specific roles. He encouraged aspiring actors to take on diverse characters and challenge themselves, just as he did throughout his career. Furthermore, Reynolds emphasized the importance of perseverance in the face of adversity. The film industry can be notoriously difficult to break into, and Reynolds knew firsthand the challenges that come with pursuing a career in acting. However, he remained steadfast in his determination to succeed and encouraged others to do the same. Reynolds' legacy will continue to resonate within the industry for years to come. As a trailblazer and a true icon, he leaves behind a wealth of knowledge and inspiration for future generations of actors to draw upon. By staying true to oneself and never giving up, anyone can leave their own indelible mark on the world. Burt Reynolds' journey in the entertainment industry was nothing short of passionate and innovative. Born on February 11, 1936, in Waycross, Georgia, Reynolds' interest in acting began at a young age. He attended Florida State University on a football scholarship, but an injury led him to pursue a career in acting instead. Reynolds' career spanned over five decades, and he left an indelible mark on the industry. He became a household name in the 1970s and 1980s, known for his charisma, good looks, and versatile acting abilities. Reynolds starred in numerous films, including Deliverance, Smokey, and The Bandit, and Boogie Nights, for which he received an Academy Award nomination. Reynolds' passion for acting was evident in every role he played. He brought a unique energy and enthusiasm to each project, often taking on challenging and unconventional roles. His innovative approach to acting helped to shape the industry and inspire future generations of actors. Despite facing personal and professional setbacks throughout his career, Reynolds never gave up. He persevered through tough times and continued to pursue his passion for acting. His resilience and determination serve as a powerful reminder of the importance of creativity and perseverance. Reynolds' impact on the entertainment industry is enduring. His work resonates with audiences today and his legacy continues to inspire new generations of actors and filmmakers. Through his passion, innovation, and perseverance, Reynolds left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. In the end, Burt Reynolds' journey serves as a testament to the power of creativity and perseverance. His story is a reminder that with passion and determination, anyone can make a lasting impact on the world. Without a doubt, Burt Reynolds left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. With a career spanning over five decades, he graced both the big and small screens, captivating audiences with his charisma and talent. Reynolds' work extends beyond his on-screen appearances. He was also a producer and director, showcasing his versatility and creativity behind the camera. His production company, Burt Reynolds Productions, was responsible for several successful films and TV shows in the 1970s and 1980s. As an actor, Reynolds was known for his roles in films such as Deliverance, Smokey, and The Bandit, and Boogie Nights, 
for which he received an Academy Award nomination. His work resonates with many, and his legacy continues to inspire aspiring actors and filmmakers. Beyond his professional achievements, Reynolds was known for his generosity and kindness off-screen. He was a frequent guest at charity events and was always willing to lend a helping hand to those in need. Now, we want to hear from you. What are your favorite memories of Burt Reynolds and his work? Share your thoughts in the comments below and let's celebrate his enduring legacy together. And if you enjoy our content, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more celebrations of the creative spirits shaping entertainment. Your support means the world to us.